All right, we got ourselves a call here. Cutter just seems to move between round three, two bulbs out actually. Um, goes to three, opens a door, closes the door. Which is doing now, I can hear it. And then it's gonna come back down here again. Like I said, two is out. Here it is. Opens the door and it keeps doing it over and over again. Uh, my first guess is that there is a two call in and our two S relay uh, is dead and it can't stop there so it just keeps going between here and here if i were to go downstairs i bet um that i could get it to come down here <clears throat> excuse me um, but we don't really need to worry about that i'm going to go up to i think i'll see that the light uh the two call light is on um anyways then there i can get the key and then we'll go upstairs and have a look all right so like i said here i am at uh, the second floor of the floor, it is registered and it's not stopping. So I would be willing to bet that the 2S two, two relay isn't picking up. Um, before I even go upstairs, I'm gonna go back up to the car uh, and bring up a replacement in case I have to change it. And I'm sure that I will. So once we get upstairs with everything, we'll check back in. <clears throat> Okay, so still happening, right? We can see our, even though it's three C, that's two, because there's a basement which they call one of the controller. So that's in. Right now it's picked up one S, which is the main floor, right? And then because this is in, this picks up, it should stop. So that drops, that should pick up, doesn't. Not stopping at the floor. And then it stops once it gets to the floor above. Um, I already have put a meter on here. I can see that there's power going to it, um, even though it's not picking up. So we clearly have a bad coil. So I'm going to shut it off and replace 3S. Um, it's very difficult to show um, on the meter. So you'll just have to take my word for it. But we'll get uh, a new one on there right now. Okay, before I take this apart, this is a 4-4 original relay. Four open, four closed. Got an Eaton. It's a 208 coil. Eaton 4-0 <clears throat> relay with an 04 auxiliary. We, uh, we'll take a look once we've got this one off. Okay, here's a look at the relay. These are our little shunt wires. Now, if we have a little closer look here, looks like we got it broken on. So that will do it. Okay, we got our new relay in there. Yes, like I said. Um, I should say earlier in the video, uh, when I was saying the 2S light, or sorry, the 2 light bulb uh, in the indicator was out, um, I don't believe the light bulb is actually out. It's a product of the uh, S relay not picking up. Um, and we will confirm that once we've got, uh, once we turn it on, which we're going to do right now actually. Going on. Here a bunch of stuff happens. It's at the fourth floor. So here we go. There it is. No, like I said, that says 3S, but that's the second floor uh, because there is a basement, so B, L, and then two. But uh, we'll bring it down a level. And make sure it stops on the way up as well. Okay. Call back in. There it is. 
is. Beautiful. Brooks is getting a little squeaky too. I think we might need to uh, do a tear down on those soon. We'll have a look and uh, when we do, we'll hopefully get a nice video of it. Let's go have a look downstairs, make sure that light's on, but other than that, we are successful. Okay, here we are on the elevator. We're gonna put the two call in. Now this time, I'll stop, obviously. Four. There we go, I'm stopping at two. Two's lined up. Go down to the lobby. We'll send it back up the two to make sure the bulb out there is also working just fine. Well, I'm pretty confident that it is. Okay, we've got the two call in. Alright, very good. Thanks for watching.